really private, but we'll sting if you get close. Huh? And they rule by planet Mars, they stay determined and don't go. go. Don't make a Scorpio strike because they venom pack a punch. So you better come correct, cause like a shark, you can't get much. Scorpios get what they want, and what they want is what they get. That's they appreciate the ones they love, they ain't what the fake shit. Uh-uh. They don't really like people switching up, uh-uh. and they can't be kinda controlling like bitch. Shut the fuck up. Shut Scorpios up. are leaders and they always think ahead. And they also open minded, so you gotta give them credit. Give them. If you date in the Scorpio and they like you, they will make you happy. They also like a meal, so in the kitchen, no, you can't be like Scorpios are often trendy and they got the best drip. And they do not disappoint, man. You just gotta tap. Work. Monday, get better. Tuesday, get better. Wednesday, get better. Right? And you do that over a period of time. You know, not like one month or two months. I mean, it's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten years, and then you, you know, you can get to where you want to go. What's up, Scorpios? Okay, this is 1020 at Awakenings, and I'm back again with another motherfucking video. What's going on, y'all? I miss y'all, okay? I know y'all miss me, too. So, what's up, y'all? Let's see what's going on in the grid for my Scorpios. What's up? I miss y'all. Okay, I want my comments to be like, hey, I see y'all already coming in. You know what? And as I took this break, nobody was like, bitch, where you at? I mean, energetically, y'all was like that, you know, but nobody really commented and said anything. And I just really feel like that's so much respect. You like, you look, you know, I see you, bitch. You doing your thing. I respect it. And you know what? I feel like the reason why um, the universe gives me those breaks and gives us those breaks is because we rely so much on each other's energy. It's like, even though I'm doing readings for y'all, I fuck with everybody who comment, everybody who watches my videos. I feel all of you guys' energy. And it's like, okay, you know, as she's doing her thing and I'm doing some things too. I'm implementing what she said. I'm blowing sentiment into the doorway of my home. I'm speaking abundance. You got to give yourself trial and error so you see. And you, you know, you can't really be real, real dependent on nobody's energy. You know what I'm saying? Even if it's something that that you love you always got to take a little bit of a break from it you know but what's up y'all okay i'm gonna shut the fuck up and shuffle the cards hold on okay 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 so you could be doing stuff in the community or this could just be like you know you just chilling all right community also could mean like you know you're going out to a lot of different functions you're going to a lot of different things you're going to a lot of parties and you could be doing a lot of social shit okay so scorpio you could be out on the scene a lot right now bees could be following you you could be like what the fuck i ain't trying to hit you but damn nigga you close okay um bees could just be right when you jump out of your car it's like a huge ass big ass bee you're not trying to hit it you're not trying to harm animals but you like nigga you kind of you know you like what the okay you could also just have recently seen like a wasp or a, a, a nest or you know or a wasp nest could have um you know set up residence at your home <laughs> i'm just telling you okay so bees could be very significant in this reading all right, so let's see what's going on with my Scorpios. All right, so somebody is thinking about how they're healing right now, Scorpio. And this is somebody who was off balance than fuck, okay? So somebody who was just not balanced, they're, they're thinking about you, all right? And they're thinking about, are you healing? Like, what's going on, okay? With the community, I feel like this happened at a social gathering or this happened at a big event, okay? So somebody is thinking about if you're healing here and they feel like you just not balanced, okay? Somebody feel like you just off balanced here, and that's strongly how somebody feels, Scorpio. Somebody feel like you just throw me. You might be giving them a different kind of energy. Damn. With boundaries here in reverse, Scorpio, I really feel like this is somebody you was very open with. You had an open line of communication with. But something about this is kind of off here. Somebody is feeling like, you know, it's a timeout. So I'm feeling like a timeout. You could have seen an ambulance recently. Damn, Scorpio. Resist resilience, okay? So, Scorpio, you could be standing your ground in something. You could be like, I just don't want to do this or I just want to only do this, okay? You could be focused on something. And whatever you're focused on is growing. It's growing in a very unique way. Now, this could be something that you're doing on the internet. It could impact a lot of different people. For some of you guys, you're making something that's going to be like a key component to something that's going to impact a lot of people. A lot of us are like little parts of parts of parts, okay? But with boundaries here, somebody you was very open with is not balanced with you anymore and they're going through a healing okay damn bliss is in reverse so this is somebody you used to be super fucking cool with but you're not cool with this person pink could be very significant green eagles and lions okay so there's a lot of malice in this relationship damn what the fuck is this shit damn okay so you got a tower moment okay 
Um, there's something here that was met with grace, but it, it has a lot of dysfunction now. All right. You have tolerance here. Okay. So Scorpio, you're not tolerating something anymore. Whatever this ha that has something to do, it has something to do with restoration. It's in reverse. So this is something with active energy and silence. So Scorpio, you cut your energy off from someone. Okay. Uh, you could smoke weed or this person could smoke weed. This person could cook with a lot of herbs or herbs could be in their kitchen. Like, um basil uh lemons or some shit like that uh, um but yeah there's a lot of tolerance here so scorpio you tolerated a lot you could have recently went to the beach or you have a surfboard you're not talking okay you could be walking around with headphones on your head which is very weird but you know i mean maybe you you don't got the ear pods you know and i respect that you got the one with the string i feel you i do that i you know what i fuck with that all right scorpio you got a lot of cards that fell on the board all right, so somebody is thinking about how much they offered a lot of shit to you, okay? They also feel like you are somebody that's intuitive. You're a star seed in some kind of way. This person feels like they celebrated with you. This place could have had drinks or some kind of celebration. Somebody feels like they're following their intuition, okay? So somebody is thinking about how you followed your intuition and about a celebration and how you really are a star seed, okay? And we're offering here something is, um, somebody is thinking about the offering that you get. This also is an offering to the dead or the offering of the dead scorpio somebody is also thinking about how you're going through a lot of transformations and they're thinking about the blueprint so somebody thinking about your past everything that came up to the where you are how you love unconditionally with your heart and they're thinking about all of these things okay now the circle of life or the pattern of life circle could be very significant as well scorpio you could be in a silence you could be silent you're not tolerating shit you kind of going within your own self you could be giving up meat or you could be giving up certain things and trying to replace it with earth and with restoration you could not be bringing balance to a particular thing now something definitely is off balance here because we got malice we got you know somebody who was very open with balance here in reverse it's off balance now over here we have freedom in reverse so somebody feels trapped okay because they feel alignment with somebody who is very stable so there is a king of pentacles here this could be a man who has a beard okay but this man is holding the pentacles this nigga do got the check this could be you scorpio you could be a female but there is some serious alignment with abundance that you have in your mind in your life and it has something to do with you cutting out a lot of chaos scorpio all right this last card over here says um great great diviner great diviner all right, but it's in reverse, okay? So somebody feels like they're not in alignment with somebody who is in alignment with a higher vibration. They feel like this person could be introducing them to a lot of chaos. Scorpio, you could have took yourself away from that, and that's why you have so much stability. You put yourself in alignment with where you need to be, and you don't feel caged anymore. We're freedom here in reverse. I feel like you might have felt that you were stuck in a situation. You really couldn't get out of it, but Spirit is telling you, you definitely can get out of it. And when you do, once you release this chaos, your stability will grow even farther under greater or bigger okay this is based off of a choice that you make okay bottom of the deck energy it's a lot of choices that you got to make scorpio and it's like either you're gonna rise up with the winners or you're gonna lay down with the dogs you know what i'm saying and ain't nothing really wrong with it you just get to choose what you want to do and you can't really be mad at yourself if you choose to stay in a stagnant energy then great but if you choose to stand alone if you choose to do things on your own do what you got to do it doesn't matter. There's no right or wrong choice, guys. Alchemy is all about what you want to do. You can manifest your life how you want to, but I feel like there's a choice here. And I feel like whatever this choice is, it keeps somebody real caged. Like somebody's caged in with people they don't even really want to be caged in with. But, you know, it's all about choices. It really is. All right. So Scorpios. Somebody is thinking about how you so focused. Like, every time you get knocked off, you just go back to your paper. You're like, you know what? It's safe here. And somebody thinks about how you're always so stable. Also, somebody feels like you're not adventurous. You know, you kind of lame. You just stick to yourself. You don't really do shit. And people feel like you should be more adventurous, okay? You take adventures in different ways because you're intelligent. You know, when I say you're intelligent, you could take risks by gambling and winning big. And you don't do it all the time. You could take risks by, you know, investing in the stock market, investing in crypto you could be taking risk by investing in the mona lisa like these are all things that you can now invest in and it makes you a lot of money the way that you make money may not be how your old friends how, how your old colleagues make money so things are changing in your mindset and it could be because you chant and talking about how you're abundant you're successful and money flows through you and when you do that when you start to use your your tongue to speak of how you want abundance in your life and abundance needs to manifest around you and not really talking about people and places and things that are low vibrational your 
life changes. And sometimes it's called disruption to you because you like, dang, I can't fuck with you no more. I can't eat with you no more. But spirit is just telling you, this is what you asked for. We trying to give you balance. And sometimes when they bring in balance, it causes an imbalance in what you think is logical. I love you guys. And I'll see y'all in the next episode. On my own. I did it all on my own. I did it on my own. You know, like if, you know, if I'd like to thank anyone, it would be myself because I really, really 